why did I take so many risks in the last episode? Hey gang, it's Ark. Welcome back to our interloper mapping challenge in the long dark. So we've got a couple of things to take care of here. Let me get some light in here so we can see what's going on. Uh, my hope is this will be our last full day in the mountain town region. Uh, let's see, we should have some meat that we can drop here. We're going to want to harvest these before we go to bed. And I'll deal with the rest of my... I have a lot of inventory. Let me actually just grab some more water. I don't know if I have enough on me, but if I take another bottle, then it should be fine for the night. And we are going to need to eat something before we go to bed. We've got some cattails and probably some other snack food items. Alright, so this is where we'll be sleeping. We shouldn't need any more light. There's no curtains in here, but that's fine. I think we've got some crafting and stuff to do. Alright, actually, before I do this, it is a little bit into the night. I want to see about repairing one of these clothing items. Uh, we might have enough light to pull this off. Let's see, which of these is in worse condition? Got a 52%. Oh, that takes an hour to do. We don't have an hour. I was thinking maybe we could get uh, half an hour in. Alright, let's just go ahead and eat a bunch of cattails for now, I think. In the morning, we'll cook up all this meat, and we'll probably cook some of our canned food and eat it as well. Let's go to the food tab here. Alright, so things that I need to do. Uh, we have to go back to the farmhouse and grab the last of the rabbit skins that we have curing there. And... We need to group all of our gear up at the gasoline station. And then we'll get fully rested there, choose what gear we want to carry with us, and we should be able to head out. So, I should be able to do all of that tomorrow and possibly even make the trip um, towards the end of tomorrow. Alright, that's all I'm going to eat for right now. Go ahead and harvest these. Uh, this does take a bit longer. I I think I worked this out that it's uh, quicker if you let it fully freeze first, but I'm not going to worry about it. It's not that much time. Okay, and then... Hmm... Okay, that's the other one. Get all the meat off of that. And then I'll just drop this meat next to the bed here. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Yeah, I'm carrying a lot right now, but I'll deal with it in the morning. Okay, now we have so many rose hips. I believe these do get uh, more weight efficient when they're crafted. So I'll put, I'm just gonna put an hour into this. Actually, let's do this birch bark first. And then it's getting pretty late. I'll put an hour into the rose hips and then we'll sleep. Okay, we got plenty of calories. We'll drink water. And then let's go ahead and sleep. I can find the bed again. There it is. And maybe I should only be sleeping for nine hours at a time. Um, now that I don't really need the full condition gain. 
not that big of a deal. Um, we're gonna end up resting up fully before we leave anyway. Okay. Let's grab... Don't need that. This stuff should all be fully cured. I'm gonna take that downstairs. Got some meat that I dropped here. Okay, so that's everything from here. And let's see what the situation is outside. Might be able to start a fire out here. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna have sun. Look for wolves in the immediate area before I stand here. Some extra charcoal. Oh yeah, I do need to um, magnifying glass, cattail head. Sure. Well, I guess I only need to use a stick. Only a 60% chance. Um, you know what? I should have books. Grab a couple of these. Okay, magnifying lens, Kato Hood book. This is an 80% chance. And you know what? I actually probably still have some accelerant on me. I think in the last episode, my fire starting skill may have increased. So I'll have to take a look at, um, take a look at that, too. Perfect. Okay, so now we can just use this torch to start a fire inside and we'll do some cooking. Okay, so all I have is this lamp oil. I don't want to spend that. Come on, little fire. Alright, so we can put this away for now. And while we're cooking, we're going to get our inventory organized. But to start with, let's throw... Let's see, coal is really efficient to carry around. We'll be taking that with us. When we leave. Um... I think Cedar and Reclaimed are both fairly fuel efficient. I don't know how much I'm actually going to carry with me, but I will prefer to put stuff like this fire log. I can carry that with me. Take all these sticks. This pack is getting kind of heavy. I'm just going to go ahead and add all these sticks to the fire. We definitely don't need to fire that long, so... I'm not really worried about conserving fuel right now, but maybe I should have left more here. Um, let's see, I guess I want to just grab this meat directly off of the ground here. So I'll put that, and these two. It looks like there's an extra piece. Hmm... I had two pieces of the venison. Okay, well in 15 minutes that'll be done and we can throw the other one on. We got plenty of water. Let's just grab some of that and... Could make um, another couple of teas, I guess. Let's see, I already have all this coffee I'm carrying with me. So we'll make one medicinal tea here. And then... I want to carry all of that sure with me. Now, we're really going to have to go through and um, 
decide what exactly is worth taking with me. So now, which one of these is in the lowest condition? It's like the peaches. Um, let's see. I probably want to do this last. All right, let's start figuring out what's weighing us down. Uh, before we do that, I want to take this lantern. I already went through all the clothing. This is ready to eat. Go ahead and throw the other one on. And that's ready. Okay, so we got ten minutes. Don't need to take charcoal with me. I'm gonna take leather. I'm gonna carry all the sewing kits with me. I'm leaving the paint here. I'm probably gonna set up a central base at the Mystery Lake camp office. And that's where I'll leave um, resources. I don't need to carry cloth with me. I don't need to carry this extra stuff. So I'm gonna leave that here. And I also don't need to carry this cedar firewood with me. So let's just leave that here. Got books. We don't need that. I didn't end up burning that. The reclaimed wood I might carry, so I'll keep that on me right now. Don't need this stuff. Take the accelerant with me, or use it to start a fire. And I'm going to take all the matches, just because I want to have them at a more central location. Even though I don't need them right now. Okay, so that's good for all of that. Let's see. This is done. Wow, we're really close to our limit still here. So we're going to have to come up with even more stuff to get rid of, I think. I really do want to carry the jerry can back with me. The scrap metal is useful, although I could always hacksaw more once I'm there. It does take extra energy. I could just harvest this. How long does that take? Takes an hour. Alright, that's an option that I might pursue later. Let's see how we're doing here. Okay, so these will all be done shortly. We don't need any more water. I want to carry all this leather with me. Unlike cloth, that's fairly rare. And I think I'd put some stuff over here, but I think it's all stuff that I definitely do not need. Yeah, I don't need any of this. Okay, so we're probably going to be slightly overburdened heading over to the... Um, the farm. And actually, we don't even have a reasonable way to cook any of our canned food and eat it, because we've filled our calorie meter just with that meat. Um, I'm going to leave all the cooking pots here. We have more cooking pots in Mystery Lake, and that is just not a priority. All right, let's see if we can get some high-quality torches, although I'm probably only going to take a couple of them. Um, you know what? Given that this is not a priority to carry, I'm just going to keep a couple of these. Okay, that's a really nice one. I will drop some... Um, I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. At the end of this process. 
Alright, so we're going to end up wasting some of this fuel. I'm not going to stand here and hold torches forever. Okay, so going through all this again. That could be crafted to save a little bit of weight. Uh, let's just go this way. We have more water than we need. We could break down one of these. Probably some of the shoes that we picked up. We don't need to carry all this reclaimed wood. Could leave some of the coal behind, but I will probably elect to carry it. Let's get rid of the lowest condition of these torches. 31%, 31%, 33%. Alright, and I am going to attempt to carry some of those with me. We don't need all these extra cans. Let me just do um, that. Oops, we didn't select water to get the can. Okay, we're still over. We have that accelerant that we'll probably use to start a fire at some point. Um, or we may just leave it behind. Definitely keeping the emergency stim. I'm gonna leave these at the camp office. Okay. I think we are ready. We're going to say goodbye to this location. Double checking. I already have a pry bar, I don't need the second one. Okay. Let's uh, carry a torch with us. We're gonna head out. And actually, I'm just remembering that one of the things I wanted to do was map this very last location. We should be somewhere right in here. Um, yeah, so I think I want to try to map. Where's the highest point I can stand that's relatively close to here? Uh, you know what, I'm just going to get rid of this torch. We'll go grab another one from inside once we're done here. Eh, close enough. I could probably go stand somewhere up there, but I'll just um, map from here. Yeah, okay. So we missed a little bit of the map in here. I'm probably not going to worry about that. <laughs> and we're not going to be outside for long, so I'm not going to worry about getting warmed up. I'm just going to grab another torch, and then we'll leave. Fastest and safest route to the farm is probably down this road. It would be great if I could somehow still fairly early morning. I could get over there and get set up in time and sleep till I'm fully rested. I might be able to set out in the mid to late evening to go back to Mystery Lake. So if I have to make choices up here about whether I'm going to spend time on things, I think I'd prefer to just move as quickly as possible. Okay, we got a wolf on the road, right there, and more wolves over there. So I'm going to cut right through here, let's uh, get another torch out.
That is a very close wolf. He did not detect me somehow, but that was um, unexpected. All right, let's get inside. Somebody figured out we're here. All right, now am I gonna be here long enough? Uh, no, I'm not gonna start a fire. Got a windbreaker and a hoodie. We don't need either of those. Here are the rabbit pelts. Those are done. Oh, we've got a rope here. Um. No, I can't carry that. That's just too much. It's gonna stay right here. Um, that is all I needed to get from here. If I had anything else curing, it would be in the bedroom. Alright, let's get over to the gasoline station now. Hmm. It is one minor problem. Throw this down on the ground and get a fresh torch. Just want to see if maybe I can throw a torch down on the ground and scare him away. Right, so will he come over and get scared away by that torch? He doesn't care about the- Whoa, can I get inside? He doesn't care about the torch at all, apparently. Okay, I think I almost died there. Because it sounded like he was coming after me. Alright, well, considering how annoying this is going to be, let's, um... Use my torch, and we'll use accelerant. Perfect. Probably going to spend at least a little bit of time in here. Let's um, add one of those. Alright, so that torch is useless now. Uh, I can go ahead and drop that. Um, if I can ever find it. Alright, whatever. I'll deal with it later. So we have to kill a little bit of time waiting for him to step out of the way. There is no back door. What can I do for just a few minutes in here? I really don't want to kill a whole hour. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is just um, make a... I'm just going to craft one 15-minute item. And then grab a fresh torch and see if we can get out of here. We'll do uh, rose hips. Has he wandered off yet? I don't see him. Okay, there's one there. I'm not sure if it's best to go around in a particular direction. If I don't see wolves over here, I should be able to cut across this field or this orchard.
I don't need more sticks. We're gonna be dropping stuff uh, just to be able to make these climbs, I think. the river and then um, we head up that way. It's kind of precarious. I don't need to go through town again. Um, just trying to make my way to the gas station. So I think that's over this way or maybe even that way. Okay, it is just about noon, uh, but we need almost six hours of sleep to fully recover. So we're going to be traveling very late uh, if we want to pull this off, but I think that's fine. It's not going to get dark right away. Um, I don't need a fire, so I think I'm going to let the torch chain die out here. Okay, so that's the way we need to head to get up into the park. Should be able to sneak down this little slope here. Okay, I'm going to pick up everything, and then we will, oh no, that's um, almost two full kilograms of cattail stocks. Alright, so first of all, let's sleep. Um, sleep for six hours. And then, if the weather looks good, when we're done here... Starting to sound a little bit windy. Um, I'll take it. I'm gonna go for it. So I'm gonna drink water. We can drop a little bit more when we get up to the next location. Um, is there anything left? I'm not going to carry those trail boots. I have enough leather on me. In fact, I might leave some more leather behind. Alright, let's um, open this drawer and see what we want to leave behind. Okay, so heavy items that we... We don't need any coal. We Or not coal. Um, I'm thinking of charcoal. My second lantern is suspect. We only need to lose a little bit. We can lose almost a full kilogram of water when we get up to our final point. I'll drink and then I'll drop the rest of it. Don't need to carry any stones with us. Scrap metal I want. I'm gonna leave behind all but two of the cattail heads. Um, I don't need all these bandages, but yeah, yeah. 
can leave three of them. Okay, scrap metal, extra food. We can eat some food. Um, I want to carry these skill books back with me. Because I may want them eventually. My goal is to not have to come back here for a very long time. We don't need pretty much any torches. So I'm going to carry the 42% and the 41% torch with me. Um, I think I have some more saplings. Oh no, did I leave saplings somewhere? I think I might have. Um, I, think I might have forgotten to pick them up actually. Uh, okay, I left saplings at Trappers in Mystery Lake. I guess I didn't... If I left saplings somewhere, I forgot about them. Okay, so we're down to 33 kilograms. We're going to lose another kilogram from water. Um, I'd rather not carry quite that much. But... Might end up drinking a coffee. I want all of these pelts eat some of this food before we go. Okay. I think we're set. So, while I'm still in here, let's go to our food and eat. Um, I think probably our best bet to just eat these cattails. They're fairly heavy. I think all of these canned foods and these chips and everything are fairly um, calorie dense. Weather doesn't sound great, uh, but I have a pretty clear idea of where I'm going. Okay, so we'll drink water once we're out of here. It's actually getting really dark. I do have a lantern. Yeah, this is a little iffy, but... I have the lantern, and there's only that one spot in the climbing area where I really need to worry about a wolf. Here's the little office with the bed. I could get another hour of sleep, but I think that would put me at the point where it's too dark to make this trip. So instead, I think I'm going to drink one coffee up here and hope it lasts me um, for both this climb down and the climb up the other side. Okay, so I'm gonna drink coffee. And then I'm going to drop the extra water. So let's go in here and drop all that. No, drop all of that. Okay. Go ahead and climb. I didn't save enough of my sprint meter, but it's okay. I need to save it up while I walk across here so I have a full meter for the climb up. Okay, now there could be a wolf around here. I'm gonna keep a close eye out for that. The sprint meter is just about half full now. I'm gonna hug this wall so that I can see down into this area.
Okay, my sprint meter has recovered. And now I just need to make it across to the climbing spot. Still no sign of that wolf. Okay, we've got the sign. Oh, is that a wolf? The hero wolf? Yes. Okay, so now there's a wolf after me. I do have a flare if I need it. I think the climbing area is over there, but it's hard to see. I risk a little bit of a run in that direction. There's a rope. Okay, so I just need to get to that and start climbing. The wolf is way off there, so I'm going to save my meter. Yeah, I should have pretty much a full meter when I start this climb. Still have our fatigue re reduced benefit. I'm going to wait here just a minute. Go ahead and climb and get well off the ground before this wolf gets here. Now, how well do I remember this part? Now that we're up here, we need to follow the terrain over here. Ah yes, here's the branch that we have to walk up. Then we're looking for the cave up here. Probably not in here, is it? I think it's further away, but I don't want to miss it on my way over there. I think I have to go further up here. I think this is it. Um, no, that's just a wall. Guess I just don't remember this area very clearly after all. Uh, but it's pretty linear. There's no reason not to use my sprint since I'm losing condition to the cold right now. I'm not in a very dangerous area. Oh, one thing I forgot to do, I was going to check on my snow shelter in the climbing area. Alright, there's the overlook that you see when you first step out of the cave and Cave should be right around here somewhere. There it is. Alright, so now in here we will use our lantern. So that we can see where we're going. And I doubt the... I doubt the coal has respawned. We weren't in Milton for that long. Uh, but I'll just keep an eye out as we travel through here. Um, I probably checked this on the way in, so maybe it did respawn. Um, not a big deal either way. I can always come back... Or that's a branch, not a stick. I can always come back through here at some point in the future to... Um, collect coal, uh, since it's right next to the trapper's cabin up here. My old torch I used coming through here the first time.
Yeah, I don't know. It seems like there's very little coal in here. Uh, maybe it doesn't respawn with the same frequency as... Oh, no. Here we go. Okay, it was just um, not in the location that I expected. Uh, probably that way. This is just a dead end. I forgot how long this cave system is. Let's get out of here so I can uh, save my lantern fuel. Why is there a light on in the homestead? That's weird. Sure hope there's no wolves up on this hillside. I think there are usually rabbits up here. I've seen them here a couple of times. Okay, I'm going to turn this lantern off before I step inside, because this will be our save point. Well, we made it back to Mystery Lake. New episodes will be coming out every day. Thanks for watching.